Search engine optimization refers to the process of making your website more search engine friendly. The search engines actually look at four different aspects of your website to decide where it should rank in the search engine results. First of all, we have the architecture of the website, which is the accessibility of how easily a user can get into your website. The second is the content of the website, how closely together the content is and how closely it relates to the initial search query that's typed in. The third aspect is the popularity of your website. The more websites linking back to your websites and the quality of those websites determine the popularity. So the more popular, the higher your rank. And the final is engagement. So engagement refers to what people are doing once they get onto your site. The more time people spend on your site, the more you'll get rewarded by Google and get a higher ranking. So search engine optimization should be considered as a long-term investment in your media mix. Whereas search engine marketing would be good as a short-term strategy to boost initial um, sales and visits to your website, I use the analogy that SEO is more like uh, opening a shop, whereas SEM is opening a market stall. By having a shop, you have the ability to build up your shop and build up interest in your shop, which means that your initial visits or your incremental visits will come in at a cheaper cost. Um, in PPC, in search engine marketing, you have to pay on a per click basis, which can end up being very costly and very expensive. If you have a good SEO strategy in place, it could mean that you don't have to pay for those clicks at all anymore. A good example is in the insurance industry, for example, where currently at the moment on keyword like car insurance to be in the first three positions, you might have to pay 1,000 rupees per click. If you have a good search engine optimization strategy, you could be able to save on all of those clicks and um, get organic traffic for no cost. So it's a common misconception that SEO is a very technical area of marketing. So the idea should be more focused on improving the engagement on your website and making it as user friendly as possible. So one of the ways we can do this is by adjusting um, the layout of your page to ensure that people spend more time on your page as we know that Google rewards that sort of behavior. Secondly, another thing that way SEO has done is what we call off-site behavior, where we build links and we build the popularity back into our website. But it's very important that this is done organically. If Google is seeing that it's very obvious that you're forcing links back to your website, you'll really struggle to get those rankings in Google. So the good thing about DMTI is the wealth of experience held by the trainers in, in search engine optimization. And they've got a wide range of experience in significant markets across the world, in particular focusing on on-site and off-site as well as social marketing as well. 